over the floor. I'm in a freaking mood. And there's a human brain literally rotting on the side. This video, guys and girls, contains very graphic images from a human body parts, from bones to a human brain left on the side. This place is absolutely disgusting what happened in here or what's gone on in here and how they closed the door in 2011. Basements freak me out as it is, but when it's a mall, in the basement of a mall, there's human body parts left in this place. What? I'm telling you the truth, human body parts are left here, rotting. Already I've seen the fridges, there's a human brain left on the side, there's blood everywhere on the floor. It's absolutely disgusting. where they must have kept stuff in all day. Little fridge compartment. There's blood all over the floor. This is probably the most creepiest place I've ever done now. There's real slides there with blood in them. Every one of these of different types of slides of blood. machine is here guys. Upstairs it helps me. Do you want to challenge, bro? That probably is, mate. It doesn't look like that. All the hand controls looks like blood over everything. 
you think that's a child's brain next to it? It looks small, doesn't it? Unless they try to help them. Oh, of course, yeah, probably shrink up. I date that. You think here there's so many records of people. So this is probably under here in the microscope pictures. Maybe of different like cancers and stuff like that, people have died and the more you probably look through this stuff, which I don't really want. Yeah, so many just like records of people. But this is here's DNA. DNA, bits of tissue that they stick on these cube things, whatever it is. That's the name there, 1978. This is this is people. This is people's records that are just sitting in an abandoned morgue. Why aren't this put away? Why aren't this destroyed or properly instead of just sitting in here? There's just so many that I could go through all this all day getting people's records out. I shouldn't be allowed. Just makes you wonder though, doesn't it, when you die, like what's actually gonna to happen to you? Are you actually good? is it gonna be you that's gonna be buried and not someone else or you know? liquid in that bit. <laughs> Sorry? Just looking at it. The norm is Gayet. Is it Gayet? 23rd of the 4th, 86th. I don't know if that's his date of birth or her date of birth. Sorry. Or the day they died. I'm not sure. That's a set of lungs in there. And by the looks of it, translating it. It's not doing it now, but my phone said... Translate that bit on the bottle. Just did it a minute ago. I'm sure they come up like five year old, but I'm not sure. But they do look really small. I'm not even sure what these are. Another table there. There's a list there of the body parts. There's just tools everywhere. So I don't know what this one would be used for, but I'll tell you what, some people would find this job interesting, but I just could not do this job. And respect to people who do do this job. And the way everything's left here, there's a box of scalpels all left. The bit we found completely messed up about this hospital. There's the literally the last, there's a ward in this bit. That's end of life. Look at all these. It's like a horror film, isn't it? Liquid compound for micro, microvascular injection. Shake well before use. So I'm guessing this stuff, they inject in it to stop it rotting so much, preserve it, preserve it, is that right? If I'm wrong, completely yeah, adjust me on the links below. That's an injection just left in the sink. Oh, this place is rotten. Just moving along from these tools. There's a box here, look, disc cutters. Oh, I'm here to find this stuff at B&Q, guys. Or a hardware store. 
I don't know, some of this does look like it's from a hardware store. <laughs> I mean this, is this like Chainsaw Massacre? I can't believe there's an end of life you unit here. Yeah, so up there, and it's where, if you was really terminally ill, you're going to die. And they'd put you in the wall there, basically ready to go straight in the fridge. Oh, all the How about that? It's more test tubes. Oh, this is... It's all that fluid and stuff. So these are, these are probably like people's records, again. Fires in here. I have to follow the nails down. Just also found someone's shaver, personal belongings. So maybe a family brought them in. You know, to make sure they're dressed up and, don't know, get a final farewell, I guess. She was just saying that the part of this hospital here, part of this morgue, sorry. So this area is like, they call it the palliative care, which is basically end of life. There's blood pressure machines all over there. I'm just so shocked that end of life would be sat here in the ward, knowing they're gonna go be straight into the fridges, the morgues. There's a scan machine here. Doing body scans. If you're new to the channel, Abandoned World Explorer, check me out, check the other ones. Don't forget to like and subscribe, guys. I'm going to literally get bigger and bigger. I'm going to head out as much as I can. I'm going to show you everything. This was a really early explore. We had to be here at least before it was obviously daytime to get in. to get in before, it day, uh, before the uh, sunrise because the rest of the hospital was still active well there's buildings just outside there that are all closed down and obviously if you imagine this table as a hospital you come in here at the entrance all this part say is still used and then all this completely abandoned Five hundred. A lot of people 
See that, but this translates as water, water for preparation injectables. That's basically what these tubes are. Obviously, yeah, we know we're in the labs, and anything like this. I've done a few morgues as you know before but this to find human remains here I never fall. This looks quite a serious cupboard. Stuff going on. These obviously much serious skull and crossbones. sterilise my hands when I get out of there. Chop these gloves away. Polaroid. 
MP4 land camera. Obviously for probably laying organs underneath, maybe and just taking pictures of them. disposed of. saying that the part of this hospital here, part of this morgue, sorry. So this area is like, they call it the palliative care, which is basically end of life. There's blood pressure machines all over there. I'm just so shocked that end of life would be sat here in the ward, knowing they're gonna go be straight into the fridges and morgues. It's a scan machine here. Yeah. Doing body scans. Going inside this party, there's so much money, hospitals waste. You can see that like, all the money they take in the UK for the NHS and stuff. And so much equipment just gets wasted. Unused. I mean look at all them blood pressure machines. Alright, they could be out of date. But there's probably countries right. that do need them, you know? I'm not saying it in a horrible way, but there's some countries that are less fortunate, you know, and they not even got nothing like that. They could choose that. But I just don't get it, there's like a car wheel out there, and then when you come in this cupboard here, there's brake calipers there from a car. There's like a light. I get the trolley wheels, but obviously the oil was for maybe the mechanical machinery and the heating system but just don't get the car brakes the wheels in the past area this is a mock just wonder if this door would have been for like the original bit maybe there's a chapel of rest here Two in each bit. 
across the oh, this is one up the top, one at the bottom. This is the last people that's probably in it. Pinto, Coco. Surely not. Are these the last people that was left in here in these fridges? Is this their names? Is it? done and I tell you what I don't really know how I can I can't really explain my feelings of how I felt like with the whole um, with the whole human body parts like I just don't get why a part of the hospital completely shut down nine years ago and there's organs blood bones DNA samples um, and people's files, and what I mean files is in, you see yourself little boxes with different bits in there of people, and I think it's outrageous, I think it's crazy, this shouldn't, it shouldn't even be there. People in there, especially the fact there's human parts still in there, like human like organs and stuff, bones, blood, you name it, it's in there. It's like a horror movie. Guys, if you like what you do, follow me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, Snapchat, We've got a Patreon, we've also got a PayPal link if you wish to donate to anything towards the channel. Help us grow, help us explore more for use. There's also a merch website which is on the screen now. Um, but yeah, just want to say a massive thank you to everyone that watches my channel. If you are new, have a think about hitting that like and subscribe. You can easy unsubscribe anytime you want. Doesn't cost a thing. As I was the tallest, I've got over the wall. <laughs> I had the short end of the stick. I've got the less walk as well, so I can't wait. Anyway, let's get on with this. Love you all.